Alright, class, this will be my third attempt. Uh, the second attempt, I figured out most of the tricks of the trade. Uh, the trouble was... Hi. My NPCs kept Major running into Lord. the... Uh, Strength uh, and Kept running into the fire, even though I was controlling all of them. And this was because they would go back to uh, chase one of the greats down. And, uh, and the fire would catch them up while they were chasing the wraiths down. So later on in the battle, your powers. We're all just gonna go over here. All of us. Okay, fire in my face. We'll start over here, probably. You cannot avoid my fire. Now, what I'm going to do is control Varric. Because he's the least useful in this battle, despite his actual uh, arrow shooting, which does a big amount of damage, and he is the quickest to die. And he tends to run into the fire a lot. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's a dwarf thing. Pay attention, Hawk. I really don't want this story. To end. Whatever the case may be. You cannot have me! Uh, I'm just going to take control of him, and this is largely a rinse and repeat battle. Once that gets passed, it still hurts you, just not very much. Okay. So, the battle is fairly simple once you've got the ground rules out of the way. And once you've figured out all the tricks... That's the brightest thing you could have done! It's, uh, you know, it's pretty simple, as I said. Just get that taken care of. Wait until the fire passes. He dies. Let's see, Aveline is taking more damage from the fire than everyone else. Not entirely sure why that is, but she has the most health. It's probably just because her elemental defense is lower. So this will be the end of phase two of the battle. Which is, uh, you know, this is just the destroying the Pillar Guardians, and then eventually... I'll put it a hawk for a second to have him bring the dog out. And then... Right here. There we go. And he shoots a lot of fire and stuff, so... But he is not a big danger, honestly. Unless he goes straight after Varric, which everyone always does anyway. Let's see. So really this is just a question of hammering on him. Hope this works. There, simple enough. And hammer on him for a while. And he will do that again. Over in here. The power is and mine. now he's going to have two elements working for him. Looks like got the fire sitting on us this the time, which is never good. The fire will move now. along. And then and he's going to do this group heal. Pop that open. As you can see, they've set up a little maze for us, which is very nice. Um, the I'm maze... Is not that bad. Phase five, which is coming up shortly, Pay attention, is actually Hawk. not that bad. Really don't want this story to end. So this way, we just need to splattered. navigate around the rocks. The trouble with this is that your NPCs will often choose the worst possible route and then get caught in the fire. Things about to happen. Yep. With who's stuck out there? Yeah, as you can see, Aveline has chosen the worst possible route. There we go. That happens a lot. But then, ah! let's pop you this open. Deal with these guys. Not complicated. These guys are not yeah. tough. The uh, especially when your characters aren't as amped up as these guys. We're gonna wait for the fire to go by. Simple enough. 
move out and make our way over to the next pedestal. Not complicated, you just need to pay attention to where and how you're moving. Crack that open. Ha! Deal with the Killer Guardians. Come in. And really, Make yeah, it's just rinse and repeat. But they keep adding new obstacles, basically. The next series of obstacles is going to be electrical barriers. Uh, which are pretty awful, but not the worst thing in the world. The important thing is to make sure that you're keeping everyone together. Otherwise, someone is going to get stuck and then they will die. When's the fighting start? Fire. Now I'm starting to get more. Ha! I'll show you why nature's a bit. Okay. Score one. Okay. So then, we'll have mod again. Nope. Hang on. My game froze a little bit. There we go. So I am going to select just Varric. Move my oh, way there. I'll close it. Walk. Get your dog. He's covered in rock. We need to stun him. Get it off. You can ignore that advice because it doesn't it doesn't actually do anything. You don't need to stun him. You just need to hit him a lot. And he, of course, will go straight for Varric. Because that's what people do with rogues. Well, that didn't work at all, but that's okay. I think we will survive. Okay, you're doing a heal on yourself, that's fine. How about you? Now, the last form of Griffius, uh, not that tough. Now, this again, you want to get out of the way. There's going to be lightning this time. Like that. See, lightning. Oh, looks like a fire started here again. Not ideal. Fire will move around. Crack that open. You can see in there there's lightning uh, cracking around. He pulls a dragon out of his ass. All right, we're gonna wait here until the fire passes. Yeah. Uh, we'll see the fun that is dealing Pay attention, with all Mark. of this. So we need to come around here. To very end, dangerous. And then they all got splattered. Through here. So your your options are no. limited no. repeatedly during this battle. Yeah. But at the end of the day, really just whoa, Anders, Anders, Anders. Oh. Anders. What's going on? You just gotta watch because your characters are idiots. That's just a fact. You just need to deal with the fact that your characters are going to make the worst possible choices. Pay attention, Hawk. It's kind of really like parenting don't want story in that way. End, and you just have to resign yourself to the fact that your kids are going to make the mistakes you don't want them to make. And you just have to you know, support them as much as you can and blah 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 and do your best not to screw them up too badly. Because really parents are what screw kids up the most. One less against us. That, or are we We've still got one more? Oh. You're here. Sometimes move it! Sometimes my click doesn't work. Pay so attention, nice. Hawk. I really don't want this story to Go. end. And then they all got splattered. Okay, good. Last one. This is going to lead us up to the last part of the battle, which will be nice to be able to get this over with. You know, even if it's not a tough battle, it's not a fun battle. It's right here. He goes. Is there a chill in the air? There's a chill in the air. How did you know? All right. So what he's going to do is he's going to make a big blue thing. What we're going to do is get the hell out of here. Run, chase us around. I, I, can reach you I know you can reach us Okay, here, you okay? Stand. Careful. 
just got to watch because he's going to lay down a... At some point, he's going to lay down a blue thing. But, what are you doing? It's attacking. Why do you need to get this close? Anyway, there's going to be a blue thing on the ground at some point. There we go. Just got to move everyone out of it. Like that. And stay out of it. He'll come after you. He hates you. He wants you to die. And the blue thing may make a repeat appearance. It's possible. But at this point, your characters, you can let the AI take over again. Speaking of which, dog. And it should be fine from, like, from this point on. Not a difficult battle. The only hard part was dealing with the. What are you doing? The only hard part was dealing with that BS earlier on. can't control the dog, so... Oh, looks like the dog got the killing blow. Thanks for lagging, I'm the most important part. Goodbye, Corypheus. Farewell. It was their bad luck we're so skilled. Alright. And that's that. We have defeated Corypheus. And now I guess we just... Oops. Where are we going? How should I know? Do I look like the leader of this merry band of misfits? <laughs> Grab whatever he's got. Row with a silent one. Nice. Seal of Dumont. Only Anders can use it. Weird. Nice, though. That amulet. No one's used that pattern since before the first blight. It was unique to a small sect in Devinter, who worshipped the god Dumat. Corypheus really was an ancient magister. I always thought the Black City was just a story. Yep. Maybe the Chantry's right about other things too. No. I, uh, I I'll need to study this further. Okay. Let's see what these guys A have magister. To say. What if the Chantry was right? No one is ever going to believe this one. Not in a million years. That thing corrupted the seat of the Maker. I wasn't meant to think about this. <laughs> Aveline. How about you, dog meat? No, you don't have anything to say? No? All right. Let's go. Stupid mouse. Alright, so I guess we should probably go and see Janica. I think I might go back and uh, make the different choice and side with uh, Lorias just to show you both sides of it after this. Hawk, I I'm so sorry. I feel like such a fool. You should. I really thought I could do it. It never entered my mind that Corypheus had planted that thought. Yeah. Mind control doesn't work so well when you warn someone you're doing it. I'll I should not have it. been so weak. I'll return to the commander, report on what happened here. Then it's time for me to take the long walk. My gratitude you have okay. for returning me to myself. I feel like uh -oh. a whole new person. She's Corypheus now. Dun, dun, dun! I said you wouldn't believe me. When the Seekers arrived at the structure, this prison, it was destroyed. The Grey Wardens were there, but they said an entire unit had been lost. They did not mention this Janica. And now you claim the champion was not only there, but defeated a Magister. One of the Magisters of old. I did that. Left there by the Wardens themselves. A curious tale. I wonder if there's more to it. A small matter. 
A moment for the last of the family, and an echo. You'll forgive me if I take a liberty or two. Okay. Taking liberties. Looks like we're back in Kirkwall. Just judging by this thing. Your father had stones the size of watermelons. Wardens, demons, blood magic. Leandra would shit herself to hear what he did in her name. Did you ever meet him? Or did they just elope one day? I was there when they met at one of the Viscount's dismal things. Mages were trotted out to impress the nobles. Lovely. Malcolm somehow brought dignity to it. Leandra couldn't stop staring. I was the one who distracted Father so they could sneak out to the balcony to talk. Oh, talk. As if I trust your judgment after you spread Mother's inheritance across Lowtown. Are you going to harp about that forever? <laughs> You've got a bleeding fortune now that puts the Amels to shame. True. This mess. <laughs> she wouldn't know whether to miss Malcolm or be furious with him. Maybe both. She perfected that, you know. You need something. Well, you know how it goes. I know a thing or two. About how it goes. It's hard to make sense of it, isn't it? To know that Malcolm had this life and never said anything. Maybe that he accepted that burden so he could shield us. To give us a life of our own choosing. Much as you do. Pain in the ass. That's me. Banging my head against the walls of tyranny. You know, your father was the same way. Taming the shadows with questionable wit. The best of him is still with you. The best of all of us. It's what makes you try so hard. You will always have that. We will always be family. It'll be all right. That's sweet. There we go. Legacy is completed. Card attacks have stopped and Griffey is defeated for now. Dun dun dun. Well, hope you enjoyed the Dragon Age 2 DLC Legacy. I enjoyed it. It was a lot of fun. Boss battle was pretty interesting. Had a good time with it. Hey, Dobby. Woof. Yeah, I enjoyed it. Had a good time. And when we return, I'm going to try and find a save file. Uh, before that decision was made, and we're going to go with Lurias. Probably do that tomorrow. So until next time, all the best. And if you haven't yet, please consider donating to my fundraising efforts for Extra Life, a part of the Children's Miracle Network. 100% of proceeds go to helping children's hospitals. So the donation link, as usual, will be under the video. If you can donate, please do.